In a survival situation, creating a fishing net can significantly increase your chances of catching fish and providing a valuable source of sustenance. While constructing a fishing net requires time, patience, and suitable materials, the following steps outline a basic method for making a fishing net. 1. Material Selection 1. Look for a suitable cordage or netting material. 1. In a survival situation, you can utilize various available resources, such as natural fibers, plant vines, bark fibers, or long grass, inner strands of paracord, thin rope, or even clothing fabric. 1. Gathering and preparing cordage. 1. Collect sufficient lengths of cordage or material for weaving the net. 1. If using natural fibers, ensure they are long, strong, and pliable. 1. Remove any leaves, thorns, or excess material to make it easier to work with. 1. Create the net frame. 1. Find two sturdy branches or poles, preferably of equal length and thickness, to serve as the top and bottom frame of the net. 1. The length will depend on the desired size of the net. 2. Lay the branches parallel to each other, with a spacing that corresponds to the mesh size you want for your net. 2. Use smaller branches or twigs to tie or lash the top and bottom together securely. 1. Attach the cordage. 1. Starting at one end of the top frame, tie a secure knot around the branch. 2. Begin weaving the cordage in a basic knotting technique, such as the overhand knot or square knot. 2. Ensure each knot is snug and properly secured. 3. Continuously weave the cordage in a horizontal pattern from one side of the frame to the other, creating parallel lines of cordage. 1. Create mesh openings. 1. Once the first row of cordage is secured, begin weaving vertical lines through the horizontal cords to form the net's mesh openings. 2. Select a consistent pattern, such as alternating overhand knots or square knots, to create the desired mesh size. 2. Ensure each knot is tight and evenly spaced. 1. Repeat and expand. 1. Continue weaving horizontal and vertical lines until you reach the desired length of the net, or until you run out of cordage material. 2. To expand the width of the net, tie additional lengths of cordage to the sides of the existing net and continue weaving in the same manner. 1. Finish the net. 1. Once the net is the desired size, tie off the final row of knots securely. 2. Trim any excess cordage, leaving enough length for attaching weights or floats, if desired. 3. Inspect the net for any loose knots or weak points, reinforcing them as needed. 1. Set up and use the net. 1. Find a suitable location for setting up your fishing net, such as a river, stream, or shallow waters where fish are likely to swim. 2. Secure the net in place using rocks, stakes, or other available items, ensuring it is stretched out and submerged properly. 3. Check the net regularly for any catches, removing captured fish and resetting the net as needed. Remember, constructing a fishing net requires practice and familiarity with knotting techniques. It's advisable to learn and practice these skills beforehand to increase your chances of success in a survival situation. Additionally, check local regulations and restrictions regarding fishing methods and permits in your specific area.